Hello, my name is Ron Hotchkiss, and I'm the Vice President of Engineering for Search Expression Incorporated. Welcome to Tech Talk. Today we're going to talk about series connected SPDs. So how do you protect individual sensitive and critical loads from electrical surges? Well, here's the problem. Many times facilities have specific equipment or loads that require special attention when considering how to apply surge protection even beyond the installation of SPDs at the service equipment or upstream panels. Such equipment may be critical to the operation of the facility, costly to repair, or the cost of downtime might be substantial. So here's the solution. There's a special type of surge protected device that is especially made for individual circuit protection. For Surge Suppression Incorporated, these are referred to as series connected SPDs. These units are typically connected in line with the equipment being protected with the supply current to the equipment flowing through the SPD such that physically removing the SPD from the circuit would remove power to the load. This differs from most panel connected SPDs which are connected in parallel to the power distribution system and removal of the SPD does not stop the flow of power to the loads. These types of SPDs, panel connected and series connected SPDs, should be used in conjunction to provide the optimal protection level for these critical loads. This achieves a cascaded protection approach as recommended by the IEEE. So why is this method better? The simple answer is that both methods should be used together. Panel connected SPDs are essential for protecting the facility wiring and loads. Meanwhile, the design and construction of the series connected SPDs from SSI allows for very low let through or measured limiting voltages. In other words, the amount of voltage from a surge that is let through to the equipment being protected is minimal particularly when used in conjunction with an upstream panel connected SPD. Since the design of the series connected SPDs from SSI is such that the current flowing to the load passes through the SPD, the connection lead length of the protective components contained within the SPD is minimized. This lead length, which directly impacts the performance of the SPD, is only dependent on the internal construction of the series connected SPD and not the external connection length as with parallel connected SPDs. Another feature of series connected SPDs from SSI that aids in optimizing the protection scheme is that these units are very small and can be placed inside other equipment if necessary. Series connected SPDs can be incorporated into new or existing equipment designs. Because of their design, where they are placed inside the protected equipment is not critical with regard to the connection lead length. So there are many options when it comes to actual installation and application. It is always suggested to place them as close as possible to the load intended to be protected. As mentioned previously, when the series connected SPDs are combined with the panel mounted SPDs, the resulting surge current can be reduced as much as 90% at each level of protection. This is referred to as a cascaded protection approach. Using this cascaded protection approach, the surge current reaching the sensitive and critical equipment being protected is often so small it is insignificant and prevents damage to the now protected equipment. So what are some examples of applications for series connected SPDs? One is motor drives. Increasingly electric motors are driven by variable frequency drives which are susceptible to electrical surges. The feedback loops in larger drives should be protected by a series connected SPD. For smaller motors and drives, the series connected SPD can be in line with the input of the drive. Another is security systems. Security systems for many facilities are considered part of the critical operation for both the facility and personnel. A series connected SPD from SSI can be used to protect the power supplies for security systems to prevent downtime. Along with security systems are fire alarm systems. Critical life safety equipment such as fire alarm systems are commonly protected from electrical surge damage using a series connected SPD from SSI. Another piece of equipment is Programmable Logic Controllers, or PLCs. PLCs are used for controlling processes in many manufacturing and utility applications. Automated processes are often essential to the proper operation of production of a facility. Series connected SPDs are often used for protecting these types of loads. Another critical area is lighting controls. Complex lighting controllers are used in many buildings for both interior and exterior lighting. Many lighting applications are considered safety or life safety equipment and require protection from surges to ensure continuous operation. Series connected SPDs from SSI are an excellent choice for the protection of these circuits. 
Parking lot lighting is another lighting application that needs protection. Series connected SPDs can be placed into the base cavity or even the top of the mast of parking lot, street, or highway lighting poles. As mentioned with the lighting controllers, these types of lights are often considered critical life safety devices. Protecting these circuits with series connected SPDs from SSI can aid in preventing downtime and potential liability situations associated with lighting loss. Another application is manufacturing equipment in factories. Specialized equipment used in industrial applications must be protected to prevent downtime. SSI series connected SPDs are appropriate for these applications. Another application are UPS units and generators controllers. UPS units are usually not adequate surge protective devices and can let through damaging surges to computers and related equipment. By adding a series connected SPD upstream from the UPS, the UPS is protected as well as a sensitive load connected to it. Transfer switches are vulnerable to lightning damage which can prevent the generator from operating properly when needed. If the transfer switch is damaged and the generator does not start, the entire backup system is useless. Medical equipment is another critical application. Downtime in a medical facility is crippling to the profitability of the operation. Critical and expensive medical modalities should have individual protection against electrical surges. SSI's series connected SPDs are often a good choice for these applications. Controllers and wastewater treatment plants are often critical to the operation of the facility. Wastewater plants have numerous controllers and pumps that must be protected to ensure continued service to the community. Another application are convenience stores. Convenience stores are vulnerable not only to external lightning, but internal surges from compressors and pumps. The pumps are microprocessor controlled and should be protected, as well as the cash registers and credit card machines. Another application are retail stores. Cash registers, computers, and store lighting are vital to the operation of the business. SSI series connected SPDs are often used to protect these types of circuits. Agricultural irrigation and livestock operations are another candidate for series connected SPDs. Sophisticated controllers from watering systems must be protected to ensure crop survival. In poultry, swine, and dairy operations, cooling equipment must be protected from lightning to prevent overheating of the animals and to ensure feeding and milking operations continue. So what if you have a special application? Then you may be able to utilize one of SSI's prepackaged assemblies or PPAs, which we talked about in one of our previous Tech Talk videos. Our PPAs also utilize series connected SPDs. As you can see, the use of series connected SPDs can be applied to many applications requiring surge protection. For more information about series connected SPDs and other surge protective devices, call SSI at 888 987-8877 or visit our website at www.surgesuppression.com. I'm Ron Hotchkiss. Thank you for watching Tech Talk.